Hello, Ooh. welcome back to the CBBC office with Sam and Mark. Now, if you enjoyed Horrible Histories there, Dude. why don't you watch a brand new episode tomorrow on BBC One at 4.35. Cracking show, that. Great show. All right, now, earlier on, we asked you to email in if you were having a bad day or yeah. an embarrassing situation has happened to you at home or at school. This is televisual gold. It's an item that we call... When you really care. Yeah. So we've had some emails in. Lovely ones. This one's from Luke in Pontefract. How you doing? Hi, Luke. Good to see you. Luke says, I have had four hours of exams today, and I've got to see, I've got to do the same again tomorrow. And I really don't like exams. Luke, I am with you, brother. I don't like exams. My worst exam was probably French. Bonjour. Hello. Yeah. Um, but yeah, Thanks. I'm with you. I hate exams, but you know, exams are our future. Yeah. You know what we need to do tonight? Knuckle down, do a bit of revision, but make sure you have a break. You don't want to constantly be revising and mess up your mind. Have breaks. Watch Corey. Do some revising. Or watch EastEnders. Emmerdale. Or EastEnders. Or that's, EastEnders. That's whatever you want. Whatever you want to watch. Okay. okay. Bad one in uh, Cheers, from Rob in Essex. Good, Hi, uh, Rob. good afternoon. Today I had a bad day. I got lots of homework, a sore throat, a bad headache, and at the beginning of it all, someone opened an umbrella inside. Oh! In this weather? Oh. Yeah, exactly. Oh. You know, it's not been raining. Why would they do that? But, you know, as Sam says, Revise your homework, uh, take something for your sore throat, and don't open an umbrella inside. That's just silly. Yeah, take lots of water, drink lots of water, get some rest. Absolutely. Rest up. OK, we got one here. This is from Millie in Cardiff. Hi, Millie. Millie says, today I had a very bad day because my saddle on my bike fell off during a cycling proficiency test at school. No way. And I also had a really bad earache. Ow! I suggest put some generic cream on, because mm. that has got to be painful. I agree. Yeah. Keep them coming in. Yeah, keep those emails coming in. And remember, we will, uh, later on, we will sing and write a song about one of these emails. So keep brilliant. them coming in. It's going to be very good. It's televisual gold. It's an item that we're calling... When you really care. It's good. That went well. <laughs> televisual gold. I've already said that. <laughs> hey, here's something that you haven't already said. Here's Tracy Beaker. You're right, I didn't say that. Yo! Welcome back to the CBBC office with us, Sam and Mark. And again, it's time for... When you really care. Oh, I yeah. love it. I love it. It's brilliant, isn't it? Yeah. Now, you've been emailing in, you know, if you've had a bad day yeah. or you've had an embarrassing situation. And we've had, we've had a few emails in. Yeah. First one is uh, from Molly, age right. 11 in Hertfordshire. Good afternoon. Says, my day's been really bad because before school, my sister trapped my fingers in the car door. Oh. Ow. At school, my teacher told me off for laughing. Ooh. And uh, right now, my mom is nagging me to do homework. Mm. And uh, P.S. It says, I love you, Mark. So, <laughs> thanks, Molly. Nice. Um, says, um, your fingers trapped in the door. I sit. Oh, I, I sit. sit. I sit. And uh, teacher, I'm, uh, I'm going to tell you off. Yeah! Because... There's no, no need to have a go at her for laughing in class. You know, she's enjoying her work. Hey, listen. All right. That's good. And, uh, <laughs> Mum, don't nag her to do homework. If she's right-handed, she's going to struggle because she's had her fingers. Yeah, yeah. that's a great yeah. point. Card that's so, a great you know. point. What yep. you got? I've got one here from Chloe in Dorset. Hi, Chloe. Hiya. Chloe says, I have had a very embarrassing day. Ooh. I was playing a skipping game with my friend Jenny when I got caught in the rope and fell on the floor. Ooh. Ooh. Then... Then we thought we'd we could do some handstands, and I flipped over and fell on my side. I wasn't hurt; it was just so embarrassing. The third thing I did was I went to the loo and I was washing my hands, and I splashed water all over me. Chloe, I suggest you invest in a stunt woman. <laughs> she can do all your stunts for you, and uh, you'll not get hurt or anything. That's a cracking idea. Save I up reckon. the pocket money. <laughs> this one's from Tasha. Hey, yeah. He said, "I've had a horrible day today. I have got chicken pox. They're really itchy, and I've mm. had them for four days now." I've been bored all day, but I've been watching CBBC, so that made me smile. Now, don't, listen, don't pick it because I had chicken pox and I've got this dent in my head, so put some calamari lotion on and uh, you take it easy, Tasha, all right? Nice one. Hey, keep your emails coming in. We will be reading some more right after Hotel Trouble and later on, we will pick one of these emails, we will write a song about that email and we will sing it to the nation. You are very lucky. Hi there, Dr. Sam and Dr. Mark here, trying to help you guys out in... When you really care. Yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah, we've asked you to email in. If you're having a bad day, you know, we'll try and cheer you up. Yeah, or if something really embarrassing's happened to you and the only way to get it off your chest is to tell the entire nation. Yeah. That's what we're going to do right now. Go on, this then. is from Mari, age 12. Hi, Mari. Oh, yeah. Mari says, I have had a terrible day because I have had a headache and, Sam, you said my favourite fruit was only worth three marks. Well, obviously, Mari, you're referring to Sam's exotic fruit of the day there. Mm -hmm. And I can't help it. I'm the judge on that show and I didn't like it. <sighs> anyway, sorry. sorry about the headache. Yeah, sorry. Uh, OK, this one's from a very embarrassed Flora in Cardiff. Oh, yeah. Uh, I was feeling ill and asked the teacher if I could go to the school nurse. Just as I asked her, I was sick all over her. <laughs> she wasn't too happy about that. I wonder why. Uh, just, you know, just relax, chill out. You know, it, everybody, everybody's sick from time to time, yes. Flora. Well, you know, you just need to chill out. It's good advice. Right. It's good right. advice. Dr. Mark, right here for you. OK, I've got one here from Adam. Now, this is funny because I have been doing the same thing today. Funny haha. -ha, ha, well, we'll see. OK. Um, Adam says, I'm trying to drink loads of water as it's healthy. I'm mm. cutting out the fizzy drinks. Me too. Before my French lesson, I drank one and a half litres of water and needed to go to the toilet. And then everyone in my class was shaking their, oh, shaking their water bottles and making dripping noises to make me wee. My bladder almost burst. So. Cheer me up. I've been doing the exact same thing. I drank a litre and a half of water today and I've been going to the toilet non-stop. Yeah, don't worry about it. If they were drinking 1.5 litres of water, they might be going to the toilet often, but you are going to look fresh-faced. Yeah, porcelain skin is yeah. what you will have. Yes, uh, great emails. Don't send in any more, because right after Trapped, we are going to be singing a song to one lucky viewer. Yeah, it's going to be a treat for the mind and the brain. Yes, what he said. <laughs> we'll see you in a minute. <laughs> this. Hi there. Mark and I have been trying to cheer you guys up all afternoon in... Yeah, thank you very much for all your emails, and I really do hope that we've managed to cheer some of you guys up. But, as promised, it's now time for us to sing a song to one of you. We've chosen an email. Mark, have you got that email? Right, my hand, Sam. Read it, brother. OK. This is from Bethan, age 12. Hi, Bethan. Hi. It says, my boyfriend and I were on the bus coming home today, and when I was getting off, he shouted, I'm dumping you, Bethan! What? In front of everyone, and I started laughing. I'm so upset and embarrassed. Yeah. Bethan, that sounds like you have had a rotten day. Well, it's about to get much better. Yeah. We're going to sing you a song. Bethan, this is just for you. When you really care. I'm so sorry, Bethan, about your trip home from school. Home from school. I've never met this boy, <laughs> buddy. Sounds like a fool Like a fool Keep your chin up, that's all I can say Everybody says there's plenty of fish in the sea We hope you better before too long We hope you like Bethan's song Beautiful, keep your chin up Bethan Nice one Bethan We'll see you guys after TWF and News Round What did you say there? I, I can't remember <laughs> We'll see you later <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.